As Nigeria tries to contain the spread of COVID-19 pandemic, the business law section of the Nigerian Bar Association with all the key stakeholders in the business community are exploring ways to digitally accelerate economic growth in a new world. The e-conference, which had think tanks in the business community, highlighted some smarter regulations that can change the narratives. Mutukwa Oluwa Shoremekun reports. The disruption caused by the pandemic may swing Nigeria into recession, but not depression, as analyzed by some key stakeholders in the public and private sectors who seek to maximize the unusual opportunities posed by coronavirus. In the midst of all this, some sectors of the economy can thrive by leveraging digital innovations and strengthening their social structures. What we need to do going forward is that we don't have to wait until there's a pandemic or a catastrophe uh, for you to be to, to have certain a checklist of um, business continuity plans that you can put in place. The insurance uh, industry is one that uh, may end up doing very well as a result of the pandemic because um, people ought to have coverage. Staying out there and staying visible to your customers is key for businesses to survive this period. I think the, the, the situation we have right now where, where there is movement, there's enough of a relaxation on restrictions that enables people to move around within reason and to continue to provide their services. So I think we have a balance. Government must make friendly regulations that can disrupt status quo and chart a path for alliance for business community, including business of law. Formulating guidelines to issuing out balances out at ensuring public health safety is not compromised and of course the economy is also not strangulated. The recession, we may not be able to avoid that, but at least we don't go into depression. The government is planning to spend so much money with the private sector, of course, involving the private sector, on power, solar power for the whole grid areas. Because if you keep growing that way, you're going to leave those guys behind. We need to make sure our workforce is prepared for that future. We need a bridge for the current generation of workers to catch up as well as training for the next generation. Justice administration is also getting digitized. Hence, the need to advance digital activities and have a workforce trained for the future. Modupo Lua, Shiremekun, Silverbird News 24, Lagos.